Hello again, everyone. Welcome back to Suikoden 3. All right, let's head down to Plainamur. There is something over here. Uh, it looks like it might be a journeyman crystal. Hey, it is. Excellent. You can see these safes. The safe screen. That said, uh, ghetto... Uh, um, Chapter 1 there uh, at the Trinity site because uh, um, that's where I had left it off. Uh, that, that was the last prologue that I saw, which is why I'd saved it like that. Rather than recording my actual position. Ah, oh, well. Not a big deal. But, so that's, those, that's what the journeyman crystals look like here. And we've got, uh, what is that? A purple creeper. Those guys look kind of familiar. Let's go ahead and uh, murder them. Well, that was fast. <laughs> and Fubar leveled up. Nice. Ooh, and I got a, an alertness room. Nice. I think that's kind of rare. I really don't think that there's anything to get on this screen or the other one, so... Go ahead and uh, attack like this. I don't think people have the same, uh, like... Short range, medium range, long range. Uh, okay, maybe those are more common than I thought. I thought they were kind of rare. But I just got two in a row. A little weirded out. We've got two uh, screens to go through here. Hey, more blade bunnies. They're like battle bunny, but not purple. Murder the bunnies. They're so cute. Not quite as cute as they were in uh, um, sprite form, but you know, hey, it is. A, this is a fairly early PS2 game, I believe. Can I auto? Yes, I can auto. Let's auto. Step fun, guys. Can each of you take one out? Yes, you can! Fantastic. Way to go, guys. I do like this music, too. And the Suikoden 3 music, uh, there's some of the, mo some of the uh, tracks on, uh, like, the uh, uh, Celtic albums and vocal albums are also really good. I'll point out one later, which is one of my favorites. It sounds completely different than the vocal album. Oh, another Journeyman Crystal. Why not? Let's save again. I'm not sure how big these slots are, but oh well. <laughs> Whatever. I can always make more memory cards if necessary. Hey! Hey, Hugo, running the usual errands? The Ironheads are he edgy these days, so watch yourself. Why, thank you. Hey, another crying lady. Another crying person. I've never been here before. A stone building. Stunning. But it feels kind of cold. Do, do, do. This is a pretty big bridge. Look at this! Amazing! A mountain of stones! It's more like a giant fort or something! Is this where the iron heads hide out? Must be. Fubar is suitably impressed. You can tell. Alright, enough of this gawking. We're not in grassland anymore. Let's go! You like how cool I am? Just be cool around the iron heads. Uh, why are we letting a griffin into the castle? It is a monster after all. Why are we, seriously, why are we doing it? So, one of the complaints about this game, there are many, uh, by Suikoden fans who, of course, 
started with this weekend at 1 and 2, was the lack of the, uh, um, the sprites running when, uh, um, on the loading screens. I wonder if my mom is doing alright in Ixe Village. Hey, you can't go, you can't leave yet. Oh, strange. The captain and the vice captain of the Zexan Knights were killed in battle, but I've heard nothing about their funeral. I wonder why. Look at this pig! I call him Johnny Lunchbox. He's fattening up just right. <laughs> He'll be so tasty. Mmm, pig. Delicious pig. Hey, crying lady. Is that you, Hugo? What are you doing here? Wow, off to Vinny del Zexe? It's rough there. Don't get yourself hurt. Oh, don't worry. I can take care of myself. Eh, uh, it's some barbarian kid. Don't don't make me kick you in the nuts. Doc, Doc! Hey, Doc! I heard that the knights sustained serious wounds in the recent battle. That may be why everyone's so testy. Are you the same guy? This huge creature accompanying you. Is it some new grassland riding beast? I've never seen a griffin before, despite it being a common monster in multiple games. Alright, I gotta say the same thing. How did you get here? No, 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 duck, I, no, excuse me. How did you get here? I was just talking to you over there, and now you've come in over here. Oh my god, he teleported. Good and sharp, with a nice shine. It's no match for the shimmering beauty of Lady Chris. Ah, uh, what are you looking at? I'm not a freak. Welcome. We also forge arms for the grassland, grasslander hunters, you know. So if there's anything in particular you're looking for... Um, you can forge up to level 7. We do have money, but I think I will wait until I have won the lottery. Ha 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 ha! Oh yes, I will be winning the lottery. You know, you might want to get a, 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 a higher chair there, lady. Seriously. Welcome. Please take your time and browse. And ignore the, la the little girl bashing her barrel thingy next to me. It's really annoying. Ooh, I would like to buy that. I cannot buy that right now, though. Uh, there's some uh, other stuff that I can buy here. But again, I'm going to wait until I have my me. Don't sell that Byaku chain belt anyway. Ah, I can't believe it won't just... It, it won't go just because of one screw! That barrel looks kind of familiar there, little girl. My kid fell down and hurt himself, so I'm looking for medicine. And any bargains that come along. Because I won't let my kid getting hurt stop me from having getting a good deal. Oh no. Do they have knights in Grassland too? Yes, they are called awesome warriors. That did not come out the way that I planned. Welcome! Are you running errands for somebody? I guess that's a guy there. What do you have in rarity wise? Um Flame Amulet isn't too bad. Belt of Strength is really good. I will get that later, though. It's a normal, uh, item, so I don't need to get it just yet. Let's go talk to this lady. Oh, you must be a Karayan. I think it's sad when human beings hate each other. Well, eh, except for the Karayans. No, I mean, but many people in the castle don't agree. Be careful. Out of my way, bird. Out of my way. Out of my way. Stupid bird. Get it. Ah! It's supposed to fly it's supposed to fly away, bird. Don't forget that you're in Zexa territory. Don't prowl around in Brass Castle. But it's fun. You there! Assume, pr assume proper formation to stay out from underfoot. What is going on around here? Hey, watch it! I said stand clear!
Ah, crap. I hit the button too soon. I was trying to get it to uh, load up faster. You mean to say that we won't be able to... Oh, this is going by automatically, really fast. No, I'm afraid not. Surely you understand the, emerg the urgency. Uh, what are we lining up for? Dang it! Stop going so fast! See, and now this is just sitting there. Because I haven't hit any buttons. Ah! Oops, pardon me. Are oh, you are alright, lad? Please forgive my companion for getting in your way. Yeah, well, what do you expect from an iron head? Oh, come on, Lulu. What do you mean, iron head? Those clothes. You are Karayan. Yeah, let's 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 be less rude. And who might you be? Of course, I should have introduced myself first. I am Chris Lightfellow, the acting captain of the Zexan Knights. Lightfellow? That name sure sounds familiar. I'm sure it doesn't have anything to do with an item I have in my pouch that I'm supposed to give to someone named Lightfellow. Captain, time is fleeting. We must be on our way. Live long and prosper. I mean... Wait, I must speak with you. Get back, young bar barbarian. Here we decide who lives and who dies and who speaks. Ah, what a rude elf. Are you threatening me? Hugo, don't. They're just iron heads after all. Damn. I wanted to get into a fight. Time is of the essence now. Very well. Our apologies once again, child. Goodbye. Uh... You just move on now, buddy. Be careful what you do here. This is Zexan land. It's not like you're a Zexan, you're an elf. Goodbye. I do apologize. Everything I've heard about the Iron Heads is true. Well, come on, you ran into them. But it is odd to see a woman wearing armor. Strange indeed. After all, your mother doesn't need to wear armor, Hugo. Not here, Fubar. Gatekeeper next to me has just been commissioned as a knight. He better get used to it quick. This armor is so heavy, my legs get numb just from standing up in it. But that's a secret. Uh, you know he just said that uh, his legs get numb just by standing up in it. He said it's also a secret. Do -do 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 -do. Ah, someone walking by. Gotta talk to you first. Well, well, so you're Chief Lucius, son? In the past, I often delivered merchandise to stores in Karaya. My, how you've grown! Uh, I don't recognize you at all. Get out of my way, buddy. Hey, a knight on a horse. Let's get in his way. <laughs> Just pushing out of... pushing me around. Hey, don't get so close, or you could get kicked by the horse. Just step back now. Come on. Let's, let's, do, a, let's do a gold rush. Come on. Let's do a gold rush. Come on. Oh, we we'll won't keeping an eye on you and your clan. Don't forget it. We're about to leave for Vinay Del Zexe. I'm going to stock up on the fabric we need for clothes. Look at Margarita's fine, sleek coat. Just seeing her stand there. You could tell how lively she is. Could you ever find a finer horse? I don't know, let's uh, let's ask Fubar. Fubar, what do you think? <laughs> yeah, Fubar thinks she, she was pretty fine too. Your margarita is so strong and splendid, second only to the white steed of Lady Chris. I wish I had a horse like that. 
kind of dirty there, buddy. Shh, quietly. I'm a hunted man. No, you're a kid. Crazy kids. Hey, lady. Hey, you. Quit loitering around. If your business here is done, go on home. How rude. Jeez. Don't let me catch you prowling around here too often. Boo-hoo, I can't find him. I said we shouldn't play hide-and-seek in such a big area. I can tell you where he is. Oh, of course I can't. Don't know why I can't. Same guy. Teleported around. Y y your smile is, is like this flower. Hey, what do you want? I'm trying to talk to this lady here. Oh, leave me alone. I, I wish you'd get to the point and say it out loud. Um, what are you doing here? You look so powerful, standing straight as a ramrod, his armor glittering. What a guy! It feels like, like someone's watching me from behind. I hope not. Oh, man, those burritos. Ah, uh, no one to talk to over there. There is not anyone... Oh, no, there is someone to talk to back here. When you're in need of money, there's nothing like trading or playing the lottery. Oh, yes, yes. Playing the lottery without save states. Best way to make money. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Actually, you can just use regular saves, too. I wonder which one I want. How do you not know which one you want? Oh my! <laughs> Welcome. Hello, Jean! Alertness. Become alert after four turns. Can I... No, I can't sell things here. You are, uh... Let's see if we can get a... Can we move the camera? Why can we not move the camera? I cannot go back there either. Go back here. Nope. Butterfly dancing in the moonlight. Uh, Gene, you got a crazy guy over here. You might want to kick him out. Got, buddy, stop staring at her. Besides, she'll be joining my party eventually. <laughs> that is a decidedly less pink outfit than she was wearing before. And less blue. Was she wearing pink before, or am I thinking of later in the series? I can't remember. Well, we have another building to go in here. Oh, right. Anyone around here? Nope. Doesn't look like it. Well, studying in Zexan may be a bit difficult for you, that kid. Are you underestimating my intelligence? How rude. I don't think I need to see him right now. Um, anything to get? Find? You're too young for this book. Still want to know what it's about? See? How to take life easy. It's not for you, a book like this. Actually, it's secretly poor. I'm just using a different dust jacket. Look at these stacks of 3rd edition uh, Forgotten Realms books right here. I much prefer the second edition books. I'm looking for a cookbook on the latest trend. How to serve man. I mean, red pepper cuisine. Now where did I see it? I think this guy might have used it in the, in the restroom. If you want to use magic, you must first improve your magic skills. I have natural talent. I don't need to improve my magic skills. Where's the door? There's the door. Alrighty, um, well there isn't a whole lot else to do here, so I guess we'll head on out. Probably not going to get to, um, Vene del Zexe in this episode, which is fine. Uh, I'm, I'm good with that. I can head back and cash in my lottery winnings. Sometimes you find really powerful monsters out in the plains and forests. If you meet any, your best bet is to run like crazy. And yes, that's true. There are rare monsters that show up like 5% of the time. 
and they tend to be really, really hard. I won't stop you from going on in, but you'd better behave yourself. No farting in the halls. Whew, I can go back to Karaya at last. Sex and merchants are so sly. They just love to toy with grass lanterns. Yeah, that last one, though, he won't be toying with anyone. I got it in good. <laughs> I mean, sorry. Hugo, please don't tell the chief about her. Please. Uh, why would the chief care? Seriously. I am Zexan and he is Karayan. Even if no one blesses us, we want to spend the rest of our lives together. I don't have a problem with that. I can do the- I can perform the marriage ceremony when I become chief. I'm pretty sure that's the duty of me, eventually. <laughs> look at this dog! He looks like he has eyebrows. Here you go, Brownie. I've got a treat for you. It's Dogecoin. I don't know why he doesn't like it. I've talked to you, haven't I? Yep. You teleported around. What do you think? The scenery is beautiful, isn't it? I wanted you to see it because it's almost the gorgeous color of your eyes. Oh, maybe that was the guy. Um, okay. Oh, it's lovely. I've never seen such beautiful scenery before. I think I'm gonna leave it- leave you for it. What? Hey, horse- I mean, night- night on a horse. Kid, you look too young to be a merchant. You better get home before dark. <laughs> Don't make me gut you, buddy. I totally could do it. Hey, the music stopped. Stay away from the summoner. I mean, stay away from the knights. Their captain was killed by barbarians, so lots of them have a grudge against you guys. I hope you don't mind that I just called you barbarians. Birdies! Fly away! You guys do not fly away nearly as fast as they did, as you did in Sweden in 1. Young people these days wasting their time on things like dates. How indecent! They should be out murdering barbarians. So we'll save again. Because we can. Do not remove memory card, even though it is virtual. I'm sure you want to. Okay, now we can go to Zexan Forest. I'm sure nothing bad will happen here. I will probably encounter the, uh, rare monster and get murdered. We need to proceed in a nor westerly direction, therefore this must be the way. I am, after all, Sergeant Joe, Duck Clan Warrior. I know the way to get anywhere. I know the way to San Jose. I thought you said you knew the way. I do know the way, but we're going to Vene del Zexe, not San Jose. I most certainly do, and I'm telling you this is it. Even my tail feathers concur. Right, tail feathers? Right! See? They told- they said they- they concur. Well, if we can't prove it's wrong, we'll assume it's right. Let's keep going. Yeah, that's a good way of- of seeing the world. Actually, it's not a bad- bad way of seeing the world. Oh, yeah. Okay. So, we've got, uh... Two paths. Diverging in a wood. I guess we'll take the one less traveled. Actually, I'm not sure which one would be the one less traveled. Oh, look! Holly shrubs! Like holly boys. Murder them. And creeper. And they're still ingesting people. Good times. All right, now let's murder the holly shrub and the creeper. Murder the creeper. Probably should have murdered the creeper in the first place. There we go. Hey, I got medicine. Nice. I'll take that. I don't know that there's any difference between these two paths. Uh, actually, I think this one might 
have a little bit of a... Well, we'll have a battle first. Oh, I hate these guys. Stop ingesting people. Bad. Bad creeper. And I think Lulu might be dead. Nope, not quite. Way to go, Lulu. Not dying. <laughs> Let's see if we can fix that. That is the wrong button. Why do I keep doing that button? Um, yeah, Fubar is not really hurt enough, but uh, maybe we'll, we'll... We can heal them both up at the same time, I guess. There we go. There, there is not a way to go down that way. Okay. I think there's a kind of a secret passage here somewhere. Might not be all that secret. I don't remember. Holly shrubs! Murder him. Again, I'm not sure that having uh, Hugo and Fubar mounted is necessarily the best option here. Since we would get extra attacks, and I imagine that with the Holly Shrubs at least, they could kill them. Each one could kill one, but whatever. 480 damage is pretty nice, though. Really, Sergeant? Really? You couldn't kill the Holly Shrub. There we go. We'll do the overkill for you. Um. No, okay. I think there are some herbs that I can pick up around here, too. But, again, I don't remember what exactly they look like. Ah, there we go. I see the uh, semi-secret passage. Rico, you're so slow, everyone will get away before we get there. S sorry <laughs> I, I just I don't don't think I can go much faster. I'm not sure if Rico is supposed to be a guy or a girl. That is an awfully square bedroll. Hey, Maximilian Knights! Alright! You guys are still around. Just not led by Maximilian. We Maximilian Knights are on a critical mission. The buds of war are set to bloom across this land. It's our duty to sur sever them swiftly. Sooner the better. Yes, understood, sir. I should hope so. Make certain your legs understand, too. Hmm? Uh, good day... Speak, boy. What do you know of evil knights said to be coming to Grassland? Uh, what? By the way, portrait guys, you should join us. We got two spare slots. You're not going to, though, are you? In the north, there are stories. What? Did you hear, Rico? Our first enemy is time itself. Hurry forth! Fr 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 Fred, wait, sir! What in spirits were they? Just ignore them, Hugo. We have secret, semi-secret passages to get through. I think this is it. Yes, this is. All right. Oh look. So okay. So so we can in three does not have random chests lying around in the middle of forests like you had in pretty much every other RPG. Let's go ahead and kill the creeper first. We were doing significantly more damage to those holly shrubs. Instead, you have corpses! You take recipe number two. All right. And the interesting thing about the corpses, those pouches respawn. So someone out there is coming around, finding skeletons, with swords stuck in them. 
and putting pouches of stuff next to them. What a weird, wacky world this is. And I get into another battle. Oh, this is new. Vermitors. Um, kill them quickly, please, everyone. I don't know how nasty they are. We are not doing very much damage to them compared to... Oh, oh dear. Well, at least we killed it. Um... Oh, wow, that's, um... That is some slowdown. Are you gonna slow down again? Well, that's something that I never tested out. Magic. Uh, that that was uh, that was quite the slowdown. Can we do shining wind. That's just murder. Before it explodes on us again. All right, I am gonna have to figure out uh, a way to get that to not slow down. That's. Kinda of crappy. Um. Hmm. Ah, Hugo leveled up. Got a medicine C. Let's go ahead and get out of this these woods before we uh, do anything else. I'm not sure what to do about that slowdown though. Hmm. I'm not getting slowdown anywhere else. It's kind of weird. Oh, also those items tend to respawn uh, about every 30 minutes or so as well. Something like that. Okay, good. No more vermitors. Yeah, hmm. I don't know about that slowdown. That's kind of weird. It's pretty consistent to do. I am definitely going to have to play around with that. Yeah, now my mind is wondering about what I, what settings I can change to fix that. And the other question is whether that's only happening because I'm recording, or if it's happening, if it's going to happen even when I'm not recording. Mm, things to check, things to check. But we are out of Zexan Forest. And in the next episode, I am going to run back and uh, stop by the... Uh, um, the the uh, the duck village and get our see about getting our lottery winnings. So we'll see you in the next one.